Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. In this video I will show you the world quest, the wild fairy of Erin Nyssa. Nice. And uh, in order to accept this world quest, you just have to come here into the Marcot station and you can see it available um, at the fountain. So let's just go there and read this uh, curved stone table. Ta table. Okay, at this point just go to the foggy forest path, this teleport waypoint. And once you teleport here, it will immediately ask you to go at the monument there. So let's go. Okay. Uh, repeat, just to come here. And uh, mysterious altar, just interact with it. What you have to do is to clear three small puzzles around this um, altar. The first one is right here at the north direction, so let's go. And in order to do this, first of all you have to get the power up from uh, from uh, this thingy, this altar, so just a kind bit, interact, you will get this uh, a jellyfish power, I mean, a squid power. So you can press T to switch from uh, normal elemental skills or using the power from uh, this thing you got. Just with this power, hold the elemental skill to launch the mini nuvlet attack. Oh, let me heal up. The mini nuvlet attack. Okay. Kill the small one first. Then keep going. Alright. After you clear the mud, these bubbles will spawn. And you have to basically mm, make them. I mean, you can move them using this power, power up, as you can see, pushing them around. If you make it explode, it will create a shockwave, which will trigger these instruments. You have to trigger them in order of how many um, symbols they have. All of them have one, means you have to trigger all of them together. So what I have to do here is just to combine the two bubbles. So push it one toward the others, and it will become a larger bubble. Now put the bubble in the center of these three runes. So you can see, you can cover that one, you can cover this one, you can cover that one, a bit more boxers. Okay, and make it explode. So one of them is done. Perfect. Once you finish this one, through your left side, here you will find another, uh, another of this altar. So with the same power up of the um, lollipop, destroy this thingy. Okay, enemies will spawn, just kill them first. Nice. So now use this power up to move this bubble toward the center of this tomb, making it uh, when it, it explodes, it can hit both together. Okay, this is perfect. A bit more toward that side, maybe. And in the end, move this one. Okay. Like this. In the center between the two. So. Yeah, like this. Make this one explode. We light up that one, and then make this the two explode, and light in the other two together. Second one, done. Last one remain is at. Uh, uh, southeast direction. Let's go. You still have the power up, power up of the jellyfish, so press T to change the power and kill this thingy. Kill the other thing as well. Nice. Bubbles will explode, and as you can see, this time we have to light up one, two, and the three. So, same power up with the jelly, uh, lollipop. Move this one to here. So as you can see, when it explodes, closer to this one, we light up this one, then light up that one, and in the end, hit this bubble, which will hit that one. So let's go. One, two, explode, three. Okay, now we can go to the altar. Mysterious altar, pick up. After pick up, you can continue with the story. Melusine. The Wild Fairy of Erinness. Started. Foggy Forest Pet completed, guys. And now we have the other two remaining. So, um, for this video, that's all, because I will separate them into multiple. Uh, thanks for watching, and see you in the next one. Bye!